Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This week's video is my first collaboration on YouTube with Claire from Black Summer Colouring. She's a really talented artist and she's got a really unique drawing style so you should definitely go check out her channel. But I'll tell you more about her channel later on. We decided we would do a line art swap and because we both like drawing girls we decided we'd do one based on nature and fawns and foliage and stuff like that. So I was really excited to get started. Um, when Claire's piece first actually arrived, I wasn't at home. I had a photo sent to me of the envelope by my husband and I told him not to open it because I wanted to open it on camera, but he did it anyway. So I had to try my hardest not to have a sneak peek before I got the camera ready. But So yeah, that, that was a bit difficult to do. But I really like the design that Claire came up with. I don't normally do backgrounds, so I thought it'd be a really nice challenge for me because she's done such a detailed background on it. Um, before starting colouring, I did a colour study again. Um, I've started doing them a lot more recently. I wanted to get a basic idea of what colours I wanted to use. And it's a good job I've got a lot of greens because I used nearly every green marker that I have in, on this piece. Um, my idea for colouring the background was sort of an out of focus forest sort of scene. So I used my colourless blender to help take colour off the page to give the impression of light coming through sort of the foliage and everything in the background. Um, for the girl, um, I found it a perfect opportunity to do a darker skin tone. I have a really bad habit of doing really light skin tones. I don't really know why, it's just default thing to do but I tried to challenge myself on this one a bit more because a pale skin tone really wouldn't look right for this image but it, I think it came out pretty well it, I was really nervous at first but yeah it, it worked out so it's all good um one of the main challenges I had for the picture was actually the paper type that Claire had used was different to what I normally use I tend to use a Bristol board because I know it can handle a lot of layers of ink like constantly put over and over and over itself but I didn't know I think this is a sort of art like quite heavy art paper so I didn't know if it could hold the ink as well as Bristol board so especially while doing the background I was really nervous like the colour was either going to start lifting or it's going to start tearing at the paper or something like that but it, it held out it did well so that, that was like just yeah <laughs> One worry over with that I didn't need to worry about. Um, but yeah, so I guess I'll talk about Claire's channel a bit now. She normally posts two videos a week. One on a Wednesday that she calls Something Sweet for Midweek, I think I believe. Um, and then she posts again on a Sunday, which is normally like a full voiced over um, drawing video tutorial sort of thing and occasionally she'll post on a Friday for special videos but yeah um, I'm not really sure what else to say now so I guess I'll just leave you with some music and get back to you at the end of the video
Right, we're coming to the end of the video now. Um, I hope you have enjoyed the video so far. Claire has actually sent me a picture of what she's done with mine, and I really like how it's come out, so you should definitely go and check out her half of the video. And if you want to do a collaboration with me, then just leave a comment down below, and don't forget to hit that like button. Also, if you want to see a tutorial of how I use markers, like, or for instance, a more in-depth tutorial of, say, how I did the background, or how I do skin colours, then please hit that like button, and don't forget to leave a comment down below. If you've got any other video requests you'd like to see, then again, comment down below, and I'll see what I can do. But that's all for now, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.